everyone, welcome back to my channel. Jessica here with Beauty and Baseball. Today I have my intro for the Peeping Pan Project Pan. This is part of our Pantastic Ladies Collabs group on Facebook, which I will have that down in my social media if you want the link to join. This is designed for those people that want to pan and work on their products without the stress of having to finish it in a certain amount of time. This was designed to either hit pan on a product in your own amount of time or to set a goal for a specific product that maybe doesn't have a pan and try to reach that goal. You really have the whole year to try and hit those goals. If you do hit those goals and you want to roll that product out and roll a new product in, you can. So it's just kind of like a continuous throughout the year rolling project to hit pan or to reach certain preset goals for a product. Most people are choosing four to six products. I've got a few more here just because that's how I am. Always the overachiever. I have certain goals that I want to hit on some of these, pan on others, and the reason I have chosen these specific products is I do want to try to pan them later in the year. I have some seasonal projects coming up that just don't start for a few months, but I know if I put these products in those projects, I can't finish them. There's just too much product in there to finish. But if I have this in peeping pan and get a little progress or hit a certain goal to the point where what I have left can be put in that next project and I can actually finish it. I hope that made sense. Anyway, let's get into the products. The first item that I have is a blush. It's like a shimmery, peachy, glittery blush. And this is from my Sephora makeup palette, the Colorista palette. And my goal for this one is just to hit pan. My next two products are also from the Sephora Colorista Makeup Palette. The first one is a aqua colored. This is a gel eyeliner and I just want to hit pan on this. And I have this sandy colored eyeshadow and I just want to hit pan on this as well. The next thing that I have is this Elf Flawless Finish Foundation and this is in the color sand. This is not the one that I had in Budget Beauties. This is a new one and my goal is to reach this line right here. So that's a about the halfway point. Next up, I have this eyeshadow from Bare Minerals. This is Hyacinth. It was a loose eyeshadow, but I pressed it into a pan. This is what it is right there. And for this one, it already has a nice pan on it. My goal is to actually hit side pan over here and basically use this half so that I would end up with about half of the product left. That is my goal, just to, where this pan starts here, just clear everything out on this side. Next up, I have the Tristique Maldives Luminescent. This is a highlighter, and it is new, and it's not a ton of product in there, but this is something that I don't really use frequently, this type of product, and this is where the starting point is, and I kinda wanna get to that halfway mark and make it a little bit easier to try to pan at a later date. So I think for my updates for these um, that have lines on them, I'm gonna use a different color to mark my progress to get to the bottom line. So I'll have the white as my start and my finish, and then I'll probably use like red or something like that in between. And the last product that I have is from Hask. This is the Hawaiian Sea Salt Texture Spray. I haven't tried this yet, it is brand new, that's why it's not marked, and my goal is actually to get right here. So it's probably about a third of the product that I wanna use. So we'll see how long that takes. So I actually picked seven products this go round, and hopefully I can have some good progress or maybe even meet a goal or two by the first update. There are tons of ladies in our Pantastic Ladies collab group that have joined in. I'm gonna have them linked down below in my description box, so I hope you go check them out as well. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and until I see you in my next video, have a beautiful day.